Good morning. Today we are here at Macy's. We're going to go and check out some of the different holiday sales. Did a little bit of research last night. Looks like they got some great Christmas deals going on. Uh, a lot of you guys were wanting me to come check out Macy's. Here we are. Let's get to it. Okay, as soon as we come into Macy's here, I notice they have some different candy packages up front and center. Got this Moose Munch and Harry and David mix. 60% off. 60% off. However, look at this price. $154.99. This is why I don't come into Macy's a lot. This is... That's crazy expensive. 60% uh, off, though. I mean, you know, a little bit of a better deal, but too rich for my blood. I will say, looking at some of these prices, though, everything in here is either 50% off. Just This is like boys' clothes right here. 25% off of these. Got some Tommy Hilfiger here, 25% off that. Some of it is 50% off. So we do have some serious discounts. This t-shirt's $16, but it's 50% off, so this would be $8. So that doesn't seem too bad. Some graphic t-shirts here. They have different Under Armour products here. Again, this is the boys' section here. $25, but 25% off of that. You know, Under Armour is kind of a pricey brand. If you like these kind of things, though, I mean, there's all different kinds of price differences here. 60% off of these, 30% off of these, 25% off of these. I mean, you know, if this is stuff that you like to buy, there are some uh, pretty good discounts. They have these little kid Tommy Hilfiger coats here. They are $100, $100 regular price, which is absolutely insane. However, 55% off, so it would be about $45. Uh, still seems a little much for me, but you know, if your kids are, I don't know, it's an awful small, awful small coat. Probably, uh, let's see, ages 8 to 10, it looks like. They have these Barbie and Minnie Mouse themed hat and glove sets here. These are $25, but they're 50% off. So, I mean, yeah, regular price is pretty crazy, but half off makes it a good deal all of a sudden. And if you didn't know, Macy's has Toys R Us kind of in the middle of the store here. Not many toys. I thought there would be much more than this. But I do see some discounts on toys. Not too sure if they're good prices. We're not going to really cover a lot of this today. But yeah, I just thought I'd point out. Good to see Toys R Us is back. I found a deal of the day here. They got these really nice flannels. Really nice. $14.99? That's better than Walmart. And they look nicer. Got some really nice coats here, 60% off. Got some Tommy Hilfiger here. I wonder how much this is. I'm sure it is pretty expensive. $225, yeah, okay. Uh, special, $79.99, whoa. That's a good savings right there. I mean, I could never, I mean, I still, still too much for me, but I'll tell you what, I mean, if you like Tommy Hilfiger, that's a pretty good price. They also have a lot of different Calvin Klein coats here. Regular price on this, $150, but it is 60% off. 60% off, so right around $65, $65 for this. I mean, yeah, pretty pricey, but if you like Calvin Klein and you want uh, expensive, super expensive clothing for a much cheaper price, Macy's does have some pretty good deals going on. I'm sure it's like this whichever city state you're in with your macy's but they sell a lot of cincinnati reds different Bengals gear here got joe burrow right here see how much that is there are some buy one get one uh half off as well 35 dollars for that but you get buy one get one 50 percent off so if you're looking for some christmas sports ideas might be might be cool you know and some of these that i'm seeing here i haven't seen anywhere else like some of these cool Bengals hats here. I haven't seen these anywhere. Oh, there he is. There's the guy. Jamar Chase. They have the Bass Outdoors coat brand here. Uh, really nice coats here. These are $159, but 60% off. I'll tell you what, you know, we were looking online yesterday, checking out some of the different things. Some people were giving me some ideas of some things to check out at Macy's. So I wanted to check out uh, all these 60% off deals. I mean, you can get some great quality products that are normally outrageously expensive, virtually unaffordable for some very affordable prices. 
Some people were talking about the last act here, which is kind of like, I guess they're gonna be going out the door, so they clearance a lot of products out here. A lot of these shirts here, $9.96 and under. Now my aunt got an $80 skirt from here. And I, I don't know if they have different areas in the women's and men's. We'll check out the women's here in a few minutes. But I wanted to point this out. $80 skirt that she got for $4. So this is where you want to look. Anything that says last act on it here at Macy's, this is where you're going to find the best deals. One of our viewers asked if I could check out some of the different purses. They have them kind of split into different sections. These are $39.99 and under. I see this one here, $24.99 for this little one right here. That is a Steve Madden purse. They have this K purse here. Kendall and Kylie. This one is $16.99. So not really too bad of a deal on that. And I'm going to be honest with you here. I'm not too sure what's a great deal on purses and what's not. But they do have Guess, the brand Guess, $49.99 and under. This one right here is $40. And they have some other products over here, $39.99 and under. These are some different Tommy Hilfiger, uh, like wallet, purse wallet sets here. If I was to shop here, the first places that I would always check is the last act areas of the store and anything that says clearance. This is the XOXO brand here, $24.99 and under. Look at that, $9.98. Normally $16.99 for this one. Get that for $10. Well, you know, I mean, Macy's really does have some deals. I, I never thought they had deals like this. I know my mom was talking about it. A lot of our viewers on the channel were. But, I mean, I normally wouldn't shop here for a little. Look at this, though. $70 purse. Backstage here. This is the incline, I guess. Uh, normally $70. $17.98. They have all this clearance jewelry as well. $4.99 and under. I don't know if they have stuff like this all the time. And this is not under $4.99. This is $6.98 for this. So that is in the wrong spot. But some of these things, yeah pretty cool look at these well that's nice two dollars and 98 cents for those all these different little gifts here perfume gifts kind of in the perfume section here 16.99 and under so you know see anything you like here you may want to check out macy's it's some nice little gift packs i do like how they put the price in under so all of these different uh perfumes and everything the air apostle um White diamonds right here, $39.99 and under. I mean, I know that traditionally these are very expensive products. I know white diamonds is an air apostle, $39.99 and under right now. Well, look at this. I didn't even know Macy sold this kind of stuff. I got some different Christmas things here, some different Santa Clauses. This is traditional holiday products here, $24.99 and under. Some pretty neat stuff. I found these different holiday slippers here, kind of like those memory foam slippers we saw at Sam's Club. Actually a little cheaper, $9.99, look at that, fancy. Nice for walking around, got these different like pajamas here. One thing I've noticed about the music that they're playing here, kind of sounds like uh, Christmas themed like New York style music, because as we, most of us know, Macy's is from New York. Kind of got the feeling like I'm in New York while I'm shopping in here, it's kind of interesting. And for those who are curious here, we're going down an escalator. That's right, this Macy's has two floors. We are at Florence Mall, or people from Florence, Kentucky call it Florence Y'all. So as to where, I won't show the jewelry counter. Uh, for one, there's a lot of people around the jewelry counter, but I will say um, they do have some pretty good deals on jewelry. Now their jewelry is very expensive. But I see a lot of 50% off, 60% off stickers. Same right here on these different things. This is the style and company here. Like these are $19.50, but 50% off, $10. So, I mean, these are really nice and very affordable. Some of the jewelry here behind me is very unaffordable. And I say that, but I mean, you know, if you're buying something special for somebody and, you know, it might be a good time to check some of that out. If you're looking for some pretty fancy, more expensive jewelry, uh, a lot of 50% off, 60% off deals. This is pretty nice right here. 18 karat gold here. Let's see how much that is. That is $50, but it's a special 
1790. Oh, wait, 25 and under. Uh, I don't know if it's that special. I don't know. It's pretty, well, they all say 1799, so I don't know. Maybe they are 1799. They are. That's a pretty good deal. Okay, so walking away from some of the different jewelry items, they have 70% off items, 60% off items, 50% off items. Again, I don't want to film the jewelry cases. I don't know. Don't know if that would be too cool. Plus, there's a lot of people over there, but tell you what, looks like they got some pretty awesome stuff over there for some good prices. So you may want to check at Macy's or Macy's Online if you're looking to get someone that special gift for the holidays or maybe an engagement. This is another reason why I say you may want to check online because some of these, they say 50% off, right? These purses right here, which are really expensive, normally $90, get a 50% off, but it says actual savings may be greater. So, you know, this would kind of, I got to tell you, when I was looking online last night, I saw a lot of amazing deals. So I wouldn't be surprised if some of these are lower than 50% off. I haven't been able to find too many of the last act products other than what we saw at the top, but we will keep moving around and see if we can find any deals. I'm solely just trying to find good deals at this point. But yeah, this place is uh, its kind of like how I figured it would be, pretty expensive. Maybe better to actually check things online. Well, I'll tell you one thing. I do love Florence Mall. It's one of, the, one of two malls left near us. This one is in Florence, Kentucky. And the other one we go to every now and then is in Kenwood, which is in Kenwood, Ohio. It's FYI, or this FYE place down here for your entertainment is what it's called. That's an interesting store right there. I will say things are pretty pricey. And you know, we are in a mall, so things are going to tend to be a little more expensive here than in some other places. But they've got some interesting stores here. You got Victoria's Secret. There's also a box lunch store here which is pretty awesome they sell like a lot of different like video game themed clothing and stuff like that i know a lot of my nieces and nephews are into that kind of stuff but yeah i don't know macy's over here for me kind of a bust i like i said i, I looked online last night at a lot of different things that were some really good prices and they may be that in the store as well but in here it's hard to tell when you're looking at things that are like $225 and then half off well it's still it's still super expensive a lot of these things I felt like were even more cheaper that's why I pointed that sign out so if it's cheaper than even that that could be a really good deal but the only way to really know that is to go to the checkout and check it out to see if it's lower or to just look online and see what the real price is I stopped inside a box lunch here for just a second entire store buy one get one 50 percent off they got a lot of fun things in here too i'm not going to go over all this stuff but just want to show they got some different star wars themed things nightmare before christmas disney all kinds of stuff that extra 50 percent off is a pretty good deal lots of fun christmas ideas well i tried to just leave but i can't just leave there's so many cool things they have these hats right here too if you're a harry potter fan Gryffindor, all the different houses here. Entire store, buy one, get one 50% off. Look at that, Kirby. I guess the only thing though, is that if you find one thing, you may want to just go ahead and try and find two, so you save. This right here, the sweater. I mean, I love Garfield, but $55 for that, just, uh, I don't know, that's a bit much. So this is interesting. Florence Mall, Santa. I've been kind of walking around seeing if I could find Santa. I don't see him anywhere. Mondays are pet days. Bring your dogs and cats only for that special photo with Santa. Santa will be at Florence Mall beginning on November 17th. He will be available every day until Christmas Eve at 5 p.m. Okay, to make your experience an enjoyable one, reservations are suggested. Make your reservation today. So maybe he's not out here in the court like he used to be. Pretty, uh, pretty cool elevator over here, all glass. We are back up top here. They got a Champs down here. Got a Torrent. They got jewelry stores everywhere. They got White Barn and Bath and Body Works. All kinds of stores that I know everybody likes. I know Jessica loves Bath and Body Works, but we've been ordering those online because 
there we can usually get the deal and sometimes we'll get the free shipping. If we look behind us here, we have JC Penny, which is another store that people were wanting me to check out. But unfortunately not gonna be able to check this one out today. I may visit JC Penny here in the future. It is, I don't know if it's as expensive as Macy's. Let me know down in the comments. And to the right here, we have K Jewelers. Remember guys, every kiss begins with K. As I was walking past the box lunch store, returning to my original destination, not going back in Macy's though. May look at some of the food court, don't know yet. Kind of just moving along. But wanted to point this sale out here. Spend $30, earn 15, 60, earn 30, spend 90, earn 45. And with that buy one, get one 50% off deal, this could be very useful. Um, lots of cool stuff in here, makes things that are very expensive, still expensive, but not as expensive. That's pretty good. That's a pretty good deal. And if you live in Cincinnati, Ohio, or just across the river in Northern Kentucky, and you're close to Florence Mall, you may want to check out the City of Champions store. We got all kinds of Bengals gear, Cincinnati gear. We got a Bengals tree down there. A Cincinnati Bengals tree. Look at that. And Florence Mall does have a Forever 21. I know a lot of youngins that love this store. I'm sure they have some deals. I see 50% off stickers in here. We're not going to go in there. But uh, yeah, they do have this store. I know it's a popular one. And here we have the Florence Mall food court. We got great American cookies. Good cookies. Very expensive though. They have the basil Thai kitchen. We got the great steak and potato company. We got Osaka Grill, which is formerly Sarku, which was a very popular uh, Japanese grill. It still is, it's the same. They just changed their name. And here we have the Esbaro, Esbaro Pizza, the original New York pizza. I wonder if any people from New York, anybody on our channel, would disagree with this. Is this really the original New York pizza? I don't know. I had one of those, uh, I had one of these earlier. Kind of upset my stomach a little. Uh, Stramboli. I had the bacon and pepperoni one there. I don't know. I was going to get the spinach, but I don't know. Yeah, upset my stomach a little bit, but it is New York style pizza, but is this the original? They have the China experience. Never eaten at that one. Uh, they got the Greek burrito up here. If you like euros, different Greek foods, pretty good. They got one of our famous gold star chili, Cincinnati chili. Skyline is arguably number one in my book anyway, but a lot of people like gold star. Uh, this is my mother-in-law's favorite right here. And then they have the bubble house. It's like bubble tea bubble tea, different kinds of like smoothies and stuff like that. Very expensive. Right here at the back end of the food court, they have this giant like jungle maze here for kids or adults, I guess. I don't know how old, probably a limit on the age on this one. I don't know if they'll let me up there, but I would do it. I would do it. Check out some of these games. Uh, they do have uh, where you can win tokens, and that little glass counter you saw there is where you can win prizes. I didn't see anybody working that right now, though. All of these are different ticket games. The Dizzy Chicken. That is one dizzy-looking chicken. What's happening? I don't know who that was talking to me. One of these games. Got the Crossy Road here. Looks like a more advanced version of Frogger. Oh, we got the minions here. Look, there's Bob. There's Bob. This is like, this is my level of play right here. No talent required whatsoever. You just pull the lever, pull the lever, and you win tickets. You win tickets. Fun fact, me and Jessica were at a place one time and I actually hit one of these but it was a thousand tickets, a thousand. I couldn't believe it. That was down in uh, Pigeon Forge, Tennessee, I think. Minions, Carnival Chaos. 
Looks like fine. Easy, that's why. Very easy. Put your money in, pull the lever, get some tokens. Tickets. If only somebody else was here. I wish Jessica was here, she loves air hockey. But I am really feeling it. Really feeling the air hockey here. Unfortunately, nobody to play. Well, hold on, look at this. Oh, somebody left it out. Did they not finish their score? Okay. Line it up here. Oh, I missed. Oh, the air's not on. So that does propose quite a problem. Dang. Well, you don't get any tokens on this, but it does look like fun. Or if I should give us a shot here. I think you gotta buy it. Yeah, so you gotta buy a card. It does not take dollar bills, unfortunately. I'm not gonna buy a card just to play one game. Or should I? Let's see. I wanna see what the track looks like. Oh, they have one of these old time photo booths. Or modern time. Fresh photos, not your average photo booth. Let's have a look in there. Visit. Lavo, wait a minute. Step in and make them laugh. Okay, it's a uh, photo booth. And across the other side here, you will find Auntie Anne's. My favorite place to get a snack pretty much anywhere, let alone a mall. Well, I couldn't help myself, guys. I could not help myself. I had to get the little sausages in the pretzel from Auntie Anne's. These are absolutely delicious. Plus, we are celebrating. I just hit 40,000 subscribers. Thank you all. Thank you all so much for being part of the channel. We're gonna do a, we're gonna talk about that a little later in another video. Love these little things. Thank you all for being part of the adventure. Well, that was our trip to Macy's at Florence Mall in Kentucky. Don't know if I'll shop at Macy's. I don't know, I, you know, honestly, it's a store that I would probably rather shop online because I know exactly what's going on. I feel like a lot of the things, they just didn't look the same. When you're looking at crazy high prices and then looking at the sales and then trying to figure it out and then stuff that's broken down, it's all broken down for you online. Some of the things I saw were the correct price that I was looking at online that were here. But yeah, a lot of this stuff is very expensive. Most stuff at malls are expensive. I did enjoy the walkthrough florence mall with you guys um you know it's fun to just walk around maybe get a snack got my favorite little hot dogs from auntie Anne's. So that's really cool um and again guys thank you so much uh 40 000 subscribers we must have hit it uh while i was here at the mall doing the video i knew we were close i knew we were close so excited about that so excited that so many people are enjoying the channel you know every day we do this to try and keep you in the know with things and help save you money any way we can. Guys, we really appreciate that. Thank you all so much. Have a great holiday season. Uh, it's fun going around the mall. It really is. I had a good time just walking around kind of off camera doing some different things. I looked around that box lunch store a little more. There's a lot of people in the mall. So I don't, you know, I don't want to get anybody's way or anything. But fun coming to Florence Mall. Let me know if you shop at Florence Mall or if you go to any malls. I know there's not many left. We only have two that are really close to here. We do have one up in Monroe, which is like a outdoor, the Cincinnati Premium Outlets, which is really cool. It's about an hour drive for us, but it's a really cool place. Me and Jess might have to go visit up there to check out some of those deals and what's going on. Let us know down in the comments if you would like to see something like that happen. Guys, thank you so much for watching the video today. All that being said, I am out. And always remember, the adventure is out. <laughs> Thank you.